and we're back. But before we get back to the show, UTV got to sit down with Ray's assistant, Kara, to figure out her role is very much a part of the show as the magic itself. Check it out. Hi, I'm Kira, Ray Hoy's assistant, and we've been working together for about three years now, I think. And I guess my favorite part about working with him is the fact that we get to perform and give an audience a really great positive show. Um, I really enjoy giving back to the community and um, performing with Ray is a lot of fun. We bounce off of each other all the time, especially when we mess up. Um, but see, the great thing is the audience never knows because we work off of each other, so um, we can read each other pretty well now, so that's a lot of fun to be able to be sneaky that way, so to speak, and entertain people at the same time. Um, I love performing arts. I've been a dancer for over 11 years now, and um, pretty much working with Ray is, is just a lot of fun, and I get to be in a field I enjoy, and um, being creative, and performing, and giving to the public. So, hope you enjoy the show. And we're back. Ladies and gentlemen, please give it up one more time for Mr. Ray Hoy and his lovely assistant, Kara. <laughs> Thank you once again, everybody, and uh, ladies and gentlemen, we've now come to the penultimate act for this evening. Now, let me just see a show of hands real quick. Who here has ever seen, heard of, or is aware of the concept of sawing a woman in half? Practically everybody in this room. Okay. Well, you know, that's an illusion that's almost a century old. And in that near century, it's gone through many evolutions, and this is one of them. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a Black & Decker JS200 electrically powered jigsaw. Just a moment here. Yes, it does work, as my thumb attested to about five years ago. All right? Now before I go any further, I want to make a small bit of advice, a word of admonishment, if you will, to everybody in this audience. Please do not attempt what you are about to see at home. All right? I'm going to say that again really slowly, clearly, and distinctly for everybody in the nosebleed seats. Please do not attempt what you are about to see at home. All right? Is that clear enough? Because this is dangerous stuff. And if you're not doing what you're doing, you can run into some very nasty surprises. Okay? So first, it's down here, there, okay. All right, Kira, that'd be suitable, please. Okay. Now, it might help, ladies and gentlemen, if we uh, could have as much silence as possible so we can concentrate. Thank you. I really appreciate it. final word of warning. If any of you here feel you might be disturbed by what you're about to see, I suggest you don't watch. But for the rest of you, watch and wonder. Thank you. 
we uh, heard a few shouts of encore. As a matter of fact, uh, Kira and I do have a special act that we put together. That's a little unique. It's a little different than what you saw tonight. Um, so, would you like to see it? Yeah. yeah. All right. In that case, I'll tell you what. Give us about two minutes. We're going to step outside, get changed, come right back in, and we'll present it to you. All right? Yes. Be right back. And that's our show for this evening. I'd like to thank our special guest audience. A special thanks goes out to Cafe Azul in downtown Santa Rosa. But before we go, Mr. Ray Hoy and his lovely assistant is gonna show us at a UTV exclusive tribute to Mr. Groucho Marx. Ladies and gentlemen, please give it up one more time for Mr. Ray Hoy and his lovely assistant, Kira. Here I am again with a chance for each of our couples went up to ten thousand dollars. I didn't even say the secret word. It's moth eating duck. Or whatever it happens to be. Uh, hmm. Duck or penguin as the case apparently is. Let's take a look here. I just been informed there's no duck, there's no secret word, no ten thousand dollars. So good night, folks. No, actually I shouldn't say that. There is one little thing that I would like to do as a tribute to my little friend known as the polka dot. But in order to do this, I need the accompaniment of a beautiful melody. And here she is. Hello, Melody. <laughs> now, <laughs> now then, <laughs> spirit gum isn't like the way he's used to. Anyway, so without further ado, in fact, I'm gonna do this. Oh, not to row. There we are. <laughs> Much better. It was starting to itch. Now then, here comes our tribute to our friend, simply known as the polka dot. <clears throat> are you ready? There we are. Oh, polka dots, oh, polka dots, oh, have you seen polka dots? Polka dots, the domino card. He's got black dots that he adores so. When this trick starts, even more so. Polka dots, oh, polka dots, just don't call them schmoka dots. Call them big black dots galore. On this side there's one dot, on this side there's four, on this side there's three dots, and here are six more. It just makes your jaw want to drop to the floor, cause there's nothing more than polka dots. La la la, la la la, la la la, la la la. Well now comes the point when I tell this whole joint about how this little trick's done. All it takes is a twist and a tine of the wrist, and you all can have so much fun. La la la, la la la, la la la, la la la. Polka dot, so oh, polka dot, so oh, have you seen polka dots? Polka dots, the domino card. When you see this card started turning, before long you swear that your eyeballs are burning. Polka dot, so oh, polka dot, so oh, these crazy polka dots. Now how is it that this could be? Well, part of the secret is in what you show, the other part simply in when to let go. And then you can all do this trick like a pro, cause you know, it's all just polka dots. La la la, la la la, la la la, la la la. If you hold it like this, you get one, but my friends, that's just half the fun. If you hold it like this, you get three, now are you beginning to see? If you hold it like this, you get four. And if you should ever want more, simply hold your left hand on this side, and the sixth eye you simply just hide. La la la, la la la, la la la, la la la. Polka dots, oh, polka dots, oh, these crazy polka dots. Now here comes the best part for me. If someone said, move your hand, we want to see. I'd say no problem and show them there's three. And on this side you get one dot just for free. Cause you see they're all just polka dots. So here's six dots, now there's three dots, here comes eight dots, now there's eight dots. All right. <laughs> Deal tomorrow.
Wow. The way you do. Helen Gratis sent you. <laughs> Thanks very much, everyone. Hope you all had a wonderful time. You know we did. And um, in case any of you liked uh, what you saw here tonight, feel free to go to www.raysillusions.com. It's my website. And uh, we do all sorts of uh, corporate gigs, benefits, events, so maybe we can hire us to do something for you in the near future. And uh, oh, and also, we'll be performing at the annual uh, First United Methodist Church Benefit Show on uh, Montgomery Drive on November 7th, so be sure to catch us then. And if any of you are interested in magic or interested in learning about magic, please feel free to go by the Most of Magic Shop at 311 D Street on Santa Rosa. I've known the proprietor of Ken Gar for 13 years. He's a nice guy. And we're also looking for new faces, OK? So thank you very much, and have a wonderful evening. Once again, that's our show for this evening. I'd like to thank everybody who's watching at home. Special thanks goes out to our guests, Mr. Ken Gar and Cafe Azul, located in downtown Santa Rosa. They invite you to visit them today for live music and art. You can also visit their website at www.cafeazulsantarosa.com. Next week on the show, UTV is going green. Follow us as we visit local businesses and organizations and show us their contributions on making Santa Rosa a beautiful place to live for you and our children, including information on how our UTV viewers can get involved with this Going Green movement. It's awesome. And if you at home have any show ideas or just want to be a part of the show, please email us at utv at comcast.net. We're running out of time and I'm running out of breath. I'm your host, King James. We'll see you next time. Same UTV place, same UTV channel.